And now we're ready to begin. I'm never going to shoot you with this. My name is Jack Stricker. I'm an artist out of San Diego. I mainly focus on painting and printmaking and illustration. Probably around 13, 14 is when I really started getting into painting and drawing. And yeah, it's all because of uh, skateboarding pretty much. Um, the graphics and the California like vibe, that's kind of how I got into it. Doing art full time now, it's, I mean, it's a grind definitely, but it's worth it. I like the feeling of it's all me, you know, there's, there's no one else telling me what to do, telling me when to do it, and that pushes me harder, I think. If you don't have a motivation in you, then it's not going to happen, it's all about you. you know, you're the only person driving this creative force, and if it stops, then it's all your fault, it's nobody else's fault. I think the process is, is more fun than and the result, like seeing the end product is always cool, but just the process of laying everything down and thinking about what you're going to do, that's what really uh, gets me going. Like some of my pieces will just be like scenes off the street, it's just stuff that I'll see when driving. Something like birds on a telephone wire, someone skating a park bench, pigeons, I love pigeons. <laughs> I have a lot of pigeons in my work. I get inspired just through everyday stuff. It's more of a meditation than anything. Like It's like my church, kind of, you know what I mean? I've always tried to paint on as many different things as I can. Like I'll get traffic signs or posters or money, dollar bills, whatever I could find. And I try to mix it up and put like different mediums together and so they kind of clash but they kind of work together too. So it's kind of like classical versus the newer like, you know, urban movement, whatever that means, <laughs> coming through right now. Once I'm done with something, I, I want to look at it for maybe two days, three days tops, and then I want it to be out. I like, I like to be out in the world, out for other people to see it. I'm not really interested in looking at my own stuff. Every time I put out something in the public to see, like, I love seeing the reactions and seeing like what they think compared to what I was thinking creating it. So it's a weird like push and pull and the public versus my own head. It's, it's a pretty interesting point of view. Learning from artists that have, that have like walked the walk already, that's, that's a big thing, you gotta, you gotta take that in. Ultimately it's, it's gonna be just me. I think it's good to take a, a little bit of someone else's knowledge or information that they already have gone through. Put a little bit of in yours, but always keep your stuff, like, try to be original. I like that I don't know what's going to happen in you know, a couple years. It makes it exciting, makes it fun, makes it something worthwhile. There's nothing else I'd rather be doing.